Here, numbers are flashing up on a screen for a brief moment. The contestants have to add them up in their heads. In mental arithmetic contests like this, usually 15 figures are displayed one after another at a rate of one a second. If you watch the hands of the children taking part, each of them seems to be working on an invisible soroban. Once you have practiced long enough on a soroban, you can actually start to visualize it in your mind. This allows you to do rapid mental arithmetic, even if you don't have a real soroban in front of you. In advanced mental arithmetic contests, 15 triple digit numbers are displayed in just over two seconds. That means the contestants are adding up about seven numbers per second. Kawano Kimiko of Nippon Medical School conducted an experiment in which she scanned the brains of Soroban experts in action. The active regions of the brain are shown in red. According to most theories, doing calculations ought to show most activity in the left side of the brain. But here, the left side of the brain remains blue. Instead, the red area of activity is centered around the right occipital lobe, which is the area of the brain devoted to image processing. This indicates that advanced Soroban users actually visualize the Soroban in their heads as they do their calculations. I believe that just by continuing to visualize a Soroban, the activity builds up the ability to concentrate. This applies to other areas. So it's not only useful for calculations, it's also very valuable as a form of brain training.